very immediately, if you like, that it was Bill Shorten was this figure, but there was no evidence, there was no one going public with it, there was nothing really, no substance to work off um, that anyone could use to report this, and it, was, it all seemed a bit suspicious and grubby anyhow, so uh, I think most people just took the, uh, took the attitude to wait and see what the police investigation turned out. I mean, there's no information and I don't think the Australian went near it again after that anyhow. And to be honest, I think everyone just forgot about it, uh, more or less, until until today, um, when when the Oz reported again that the senior Labor figure had been had been cleared. Put a couple of paragraphs up on its website, and I remember sort of saying, I saw it and said, oh, that's right, I forgot about that, and that was about it. So no challenges uh, to be laid, but what impact, nevertheless, do you think this will have on Mr Shorten's career? And could the Abbott government use this against him? I don't think they will. I think it'd be really, really grubby to do that, because, um, as you said, no charges have been laid. Look, it was an interesting decision by Mr Shorten to come out and, and basically say, it was me. There was something they've obviously laboured over, um, you know, and, and assessed the, the upsides and the downsides of doing it, because... You know, most people out there wouldn't have had a clue that this story even existed and it would have just gone away. So just to associate yourself with allegations, even though they've been proven as unfounded, is, um, you know, it is always dangerous. And you already saw on, you know, Twitter and all the usual, uh, you know, forums straight afterwards, the conspiracy theorists weren't buying it. So, you know, there's certainly a danger to it. But as I understand it, he just was worried that this was going to fester, um, like a whispering campaign and, and his enemies in the media and elsewhere would start putting this around uh, closer to the federal election. So they decided to just get on the front foot, say, yes, this was me, this, this story related to. I didn't do it. I cooperated with the investigation. It's over. Now I'm not going to talk about it ever again.